Today I'm going to have a go at renewing the battery in this iPod. I've got a replacement battery, uh, a few plastic tools and a lot of the videos you've seen um, they get accused of pre-opening the batteries, pre-opening the iPod. So this is my first go. Um, I've got various plastic tools here and a replacement battery and I'm going to have a go at it. It's never been opened this. I know that for a fact. Oh, you're meant to start here. Get one of these tools in. Easier said than done. A bit reluctant to start at the weakest part. Only a thin piece of plastic there. Great, that too has failed. What you meant to do is work your way around, just leave her in. A lot of them seem to come apart very easily in the videos I've watched. Let me click then. If that's good or bad. Good hopefully. See a little tab there. These tools are just a few what have accrued I'm doing mobile phone batteries. It's a bit thin that one. Got a thicker one here, a bit beefier. That one's gave up. Nice. <laughs> Definitely presenting me with a challenge here. Got like pieces of plastic in it. Ah, you the click then. I'll just keep wedging things in it. What you meant to do, according to the videos I've watched, is just keep working your way around. Apple hadn't made this easy. Got a bit of a gap going off there, but there's a piece of a tool there. Anything I can fill the gap with. <laughs> I 
I don't really want to leave it too much on that small piece. So I made a cup of tea before this video. I think I'm gonna be drinking it. One good thing about it is when you make a bit of progress it doesn't seem to to snap back. Seems to have quite a good gap going on. See, I've took a piece out of that. These tools don't like it if you lean on them too much. Glad I'm not using a screwdriver, it'd really mark it. Corners are tight. I suppose it's I wonder if it'll give with persistence. All the videos that seem to say start off here, I think this is because it's the weakest part.
bastard, it snapped back shut on me. Fill these plastic tills out up to the job. I'm going to be gentle. Well, we're in. I ended up using a lot more force than I wanted to use. What we've achieved, the first step, as I've understood, is to disconnect the battery here. That's now disconnected, so we should be able to fold it flat. Now, let me take this off. Pieces of plastic from all my tools everywhere. They're not good enough. That flat blade screwdriver was the best tool. So we have one replacement battery. Looks good. Excellent. I'm going to keep all our fingers crossed. Now the knack is opening the battery out the wrapper. No, I'm just kidding with. I meant to pry this free using one of these lovely little tools. I don't want to come either. Looks so easy on these videos. Just a walk in the park. Just hope that didn't, didn't the case. <sighs> yes, we've done it. That's liberated. It's quite puffed up, that. Hmm. Undo the adhesive. Blow the bits of plastic out. <coughs> no one there in. Sticking to the adhesive now. Yeah, don't be fooled, this is not easy. I spent a long time prying this free. I think it's because, because of the adhesive here, it is literally stuck in. And then you've got your tabs there, you see a bit of screwdriver marking, and your tabs here, and these are steel. I've bent a few of them. I'll have a quick straighten first. Well, I've got access. <laughs> Once I got one side open, it was a lot easier. Refit the battery. I'll have a go with these plastic tweezers. There's a little socket there. Let's see if I can achieve it. I don't really want to bend it. straight it's not designed to have the battery easy access and open fully up voila right a little check for any plastic remnants on these broken tools quick blow inside
should just clip back together with great ease. It's not quite as easy as some videos make out. It's a bit gaping on that side. Probably deformed it. And there we have it. It's working. I think we'll have it in English. I don't know why, I'm just more comfortable with that language choice. We have a working iPod. It's been a struggle. I just hope it was worth it. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.